Hi everyone, welcome to Punch Perfect Fitness. I'm Ollie Patterson uh, here at my gym, Boxport London in Barnet. Today's video, we're going to be covering the left hook after a jab. So jab and left hook combo. Uh, it's a great, great shot, but a lot of people get it wrong. Uh, the reason they get it wrong is there's two things that they'll do. So they'll either throw the jab first and then they'll throw the hook from there. So they're, all they're doing is just getting an arm shot in. They're not using the knees, the hips, rotation on the core or the shoulders at all. They're just bang, bang, just trying to throw it around. See, and that there is not going to be effective because it, although if you're heavy handed it could catch the opponent off guard and shock them a little bit but that could be the difference between shocking them and putting them down and putting them away so today we're going to go over the exact form of that shot now the other thing they'll do is they'll re over telegraph it so they'll, sh they'll show the shot so they'll jab and they'll whip right down here but by the time you've gone right down there, the opponent is, if he's parried out wide here, then he's literally going to get that back there quick or he's going to step back out of the way because he knows that big left hook's coming. So that, the reason you, you throw that shot is because what you're trying to do is you're, you're throwing the jab and you might see that your opponent is parrying out here wide. So if I'm show you from there, bang, 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 he's leaving all this exposed freely for that left hook. So, what you want to try and do is you throw, after you've thrown that jab, you just basically sit into the hip a little bit. So you, you take that there, so bang, there, bang, comes round. So I'll show you. So it's very, it's quick. You're out there. Okay, so nice and quick. So you literally, you'll see if I slow it down, bang, I'm just sitting into the hip a little bit here. I'm making that turn, so it primes me for that left hook. If I try and throw it from here, all I'm gonna be doing is getting arm on that shot. Another thing you can do is obviously after a while, if you've done that a couple of times in the fight, the opponent, if he's, especially if he's a clever opponent, he's gonna get wise to that. So he's gonna think, all right, I'm not gonna parry out here wide, I'm just gonna make sure I keep it nice and tight. If he does it, I'm there, bang, straight back to the chin. So I'm blocking for that left hook. So, another way I like to, to do it, if, if he's been doing it a little bit, bringing it out wide, I know there's a chance that he'll do it again. But rather than jab to his face, I'll, I'll fall short a little bit. Bang, 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 touch, touch, touch. And that's basically there, it's just making him try and reach for your jab. Because that's your natural instinct is for him to try and touch that away. So as he does that, I'll short come round, and again, and I'm there with that left hook. Again, I've sat into it a little bit here, so there, coming round with the shot. You need to dip into that hip, there, to give you torque. It's exactly like golf swing. If I'm, if I'm here and I throw it, just, if I just swing the shot from there, there's not gonna, not gonna get as much into it as if I rotate all the way round and come through. It's exactly the same boxing, so, Make sure when you've thrown your jab, he's blocked it out wide, he's left himself open for that left hook, you just sit into there, come round. But again, remember, don't sit all the way back there, load it up, because he's gonna see it coming, and by that time he's either got his hand back or he's moved up. Give it a go, practice it on the bag, practice it with your coach on the pads, or even just in shadow boxing, just watch yourself in the mirror, bang, bang, getting that torque in the hip and moving uh, with the rotation on the core as well. Hope you like it guys, remember to like, subscribe and share the channel and I'll see you guys soon.